Hey, how's it going everyone? Welcome back to the channel and today we're going to be talking about Community Day, April 2024 because the Pokemon that uh, is going to be highlighted has just been revealed. Uh, so let's just have a little discussion about it. So, Community Day, April 2024 is going to be featuring Bellsprout. If you don't know what Community Day is, it's one of the best ways to get shiny Pokemon, especially like entire shiny uh, evolutionary lines. It's been uh, a way for me to get a ton of those, and uh, trust me, if you want to get shinies, you're not into Pokemon Go, download it right now. At least use it for Community Day, because Community Day is going to get you guaranteed shinies. You really want to be a part of this. It is this monthly event that's feature that features one specific Pokemon, um, which will spawn a ton. The shiny odds will be increased. Uh, they talk on the website about maybe if you get lucky, uh, you, you can get a shiny. Trust me, you are gonna get shinies in this one. So the shiny odds for any Pokemon Community Day are 1 in 25, which is fantastic if you know the base odds for any Pokemon game. Um, so yeah, this is a, a great way to get yourself some shinies. So Community Day happens once every month and it'll, it, like I said, it'll, it'll include and will highlight one specific Pokemon. This time, as I said, it will be Bellsprout. Which is cool because I don't have any of the Bellsprout evolutionary line Pokemon shiny yet. So that's going to be a big plus for me. So this month's community day is going to take place April 20th uh, between 2 and 5 p.m. They always take place between 2 and 5 p.m. And that's not just one specific time that's local for you. So in here it's going to be 2 to 5 p.m. In the UK it's going to be 2 to 5 p.m. So you don't have to stay awake at night if you're like if you like live in Australia or something. You can just partake in this whenever it's 2 to 5 p.m. on in your day. So uh, just go for a walk, use your incenses, check on some bell sprouts and see if you can get a shiny. I uh, I'm gonna get myself at least three. I'd like to get a fourth one so I can also keep one in Pokemon Go itself. But three at least to add them all to my uh, my shiny living decks in Pokemon Home. Um, that's like I said. Pokemon Go base odds are already like 1 in 400. This time it's 1 in 25. Trust me, download Pokemon Go if you haven't already. It's so perfect for giving, for getting shinies. It is so worth it. So that's pretty much all I had to say right now for this event. Uh, I'm going to be doing a recap video once Pokemon Go uh, Community Day is done. I'm going to be doing a video on what I got and, well, sending it all over to the new games and on the Switch and everything. Uh, you don't even necessarily have to evolve them. In Pokemon Go, you can do that, but you don't have to. You can just send in three Bell Sprouts and then check uh, what game Bell Sprout is in. Like for instance, uh, Pokemon Let's Go. So you can send them over there, uh, and you can evolve them into Weeping Bell and Victory Bell, and then you'll have all of them. Uh, and you can add them to your shiny living decks if that's what you want. So, like I said, Go perfect way for getting shinies. Community Day, uh, especially. That's why I want to cover it. Um, I want to do more content like this, talking about like perfect ways to get shinies. This is not such an interesting video because it's just me talking about the community day event, but, but whatever. We'll, we'll have some more interesting things in the future. So for now, I'd like to thank you guys for watching this video. It's a good idea to follow me on Instagram because I've already reposted Pokemon Go's uh, post announcing that it was going to be shiny uh, Bellsprout. And I'm going to be doing more things with Instagram. Uh, it's on my channel. I'll leave it in the link below as well. Um, so for now, I hope you guys have a good day, and uh, I will talk to you all later. Bye-bye.